All right, guys, so we finished with the slingshot finally. Hey, guys, welcome back to Car Audio Dynasty. What we have for you today is something really, really special. We do a lot of business with DB Drive, but DB Drive is not only subs and speakers and amps. DB Drive makes sound bars, light bars, wires, LED lighting, and LED lighting is what we're going to focus on today on this beautiful slingshot. Come check it out. So basically, customer drops off the slingshot and says, I saw a YouTube video. The slingshot on there had some really cool orange lights, and that's what I want to go for. So I'll kind of give you a breakdown of what we're going to be doing to this slingshot right here. Uh, in the wheels, we're going to have little orange wheel lights that go all the way around the brake rotors, and that's going to be on the back wheel and the two front wheels. Uh, we're going to have lights on the rear of the vehicle, lights going over these little roll bars right here, a ton of lights underneath shining on the ground, a bunch of orange lights, accent, white lights, orange lights, all kinds of cool stuff. This thing's definitely going to light up the night. Mad props to the guys over at DB Drive uh, for providing us some really kick-ass lights for this thing. If you check it out, we've got halo lights in the front we've installed. It's got underglows. It's kind of hard to see in broad daylight, but uh, got orange underglows. We've got flickering lights down there in the wheels, all RGB full color. It's pretty pimp. Uh, we've got strip lights here in the front. These actually double the switchbacks, so it's pretty nice. Come check these wheels out over here. I like them wheels. Got lights up here in the roll bars, behind the headrest, lights in the back wheel. This thing's really, really tricked out. A lot of guys put tons and tons and tons of lights on these slingshots. Sometimes it turns out a little tacky. I'm just saying, a little tacky. We like to keep things conservative, where it matches. Customer already has saw it. He is thrilled, tickled pink. Now we get to deliver the vehicle back to the customer. Oh, we're headed to a show this weekend in Shreveport, Louisiana. It's a bass competition. We're known to be pretty loud. We gotta keep that image. Dude, this is like this is like an atomic ball but but wave version with sound. <laughs> you ready? No, no not you really. Ready? You ready? So what I'm gonna do right now is get the battery charger set up on this thing. Get all these 20 excess power, 16 volt AGM batteries, full, full, full maxed out and charged. Get it ready to go. Cause you know we're known for upsetting people and pissing people off and being as loud as humanly possible. So we got to keep it up. Now this is a brand new model from DB Drive. This is the WDX G2. Uh, this is a model that came out about a year and a half, two years after the WDX 3K. The differences between the two is the old 3K model had a two inch voice quote, which was awesome. 600 RMS, give you plenty of power, plenty of sound, and they play incredibly low. This bad boy is even better. It's got a two and a half inch voice coil. It handles 750 watts RMS, although I put that to the test and it'll clearly handle a lot more than that. It is a dual voice coil subwoofer. They come in dual two ohm models, dual four ohm models. Definitely offers more peak potential excursion. This thing peak to peak is 35 millimeters of excursion and out of an eight inch priced at under 129, that is absolutely ridiculous. These subs are absolutely amazing. They look awesome. They definitely fit the mold for a lot of these trucks. People are putting these in the trunks of cars. But by far, the most popular application for these particular subwoofers is in pickup trucks. Usually up underneath the back seat, you wind up with anywhere between 1.6 and 1.9 cubic feet, which is perfect for two 8-inch subs. Put the subs facing forward, put a nice grill over it so nobody damages it, blow the port out the sign, tune that sucker 34, 35 hertz, let it rip. They sound bloody amazing. People that have dumped on 10-inch and 12-inch pancake subwoofers in lieu of going with brand new nasty looking eights from DB Drive and other brands have never looked back. I haven't had one complaint. These things are awesome. Check it out. All right, guys, we've got a special treat today. We've got Jake from DB Drive and Morris from DB Drive. Morris is a vice president of the company. They just happened to be in town doing some tours of stores and decided to stop by Sound Evolution and check out the product. So uh, I wanted to give you a real quick demo of the full-on DB Drive WDX soundboard that we've got. Uh, right now, you know the product as well as I do. We've got all the Moto line, the 6x9, 6.5s, and the uh, WDX 6.5 inch components. We're powering two WDX 2K12s with a WDX 3K amplifier, and we've got these two four channel models powering all the highs. Now, all this is controlled by a Pioneer head unit, so I'm going to turn it up real quick, let it play, right ahead, tell me what you think. Right here. Y'all ready? That is really right. clean.
when they go it's in cars. Loud, clean, musical. Yeah. I love it. It's it's almost embarrassing. I hope your customers cars. like it too. <laughs> Not one complaint so far. Not awesome. one complaint. Not one complaint. We have taken, I kid you not, I don't know if either one of them have told you, but we've had so many cars come in here with Focal. And it's not the Focal fault, it's the fault that there's not that many installers that really know how to test tune, gain up properly, image their, their drivers. They don't have the acoustical knowledge of how to mount the driver in the door, how to dampen the panel, all that kind of right. stuff. And that makes a big difference, otherwise it makes a purchase of expensive stuff like that a waste. So we've literally taken Focals out of cars, gone the extra mile on the install and the tuning, and these will just mop the floor with them. It's nuts. And people have such a high respect and a high regard for these. It's it's insane how easily they are to sell. People just come in here and just throw the wallet down. I don't care. I want those. I want those. People on waiting you know, lists and pre-orders. I think if they're listening to it, they're sold. Oh, yeah. You know, All day. Because it's All day. loud, yeah. it's clear, it's musical. Yep. Really nice. All day. And you guys have done a great job. It's a beautiful display, and the display sounds beautiful, too. We talked last week about Elvis's car with the two-stroker Pro Classic 18s going in it. This is the beast that's going to blow them to smithereens. Y'all check it out. This is the brand new DB Drive A7 5000 watt amp. Now, if you remember, episode one, we had a look at Casey Hawk Suburban. He's got four of these, but they're the big 7500s. This is the little brother to that beast. The sucker puts out 5000 watts at one ohm. Uh, we like to experiment with them, get them to run a little bit lower than one ohm. That's not what we're gonna do on this one because we've got entirely too much power as it is anyways. But I think those two stroker 18s are gonna scream bloody murder inside this car. Bloody murder! Bloody! Oh God, what is this? What? Oh, hi! I'm in a box. <laughs> yeah. This oh, is God. a big box. <laughs> so check this out! We gotta get 615s in this big bitch. Oh, shit. I don't know how we're gonna do it. I know how we're gonna do it. We're just gonna screw them in. It's not that hard. But uh, we got a little work to do inside this thing. It's a little old. So we gotta get some of the ickies out of here and rebondo some stuff and smooth over some stuff. But this right here, rock solid. This is gonna be our nasty competition vehicle for a good while. We may even be taking this to world finals. You never know. Hey guys, join us next time on Car Audio Dynasty. As always, I want to thank you for tuning in. Join us on the next episode where we blow this little Toyota Corolla to smithereens. Two Surin Vega Stroker Pro Classic 18s on DB Drives A7 5000. We're going to blow the whole roof out this car. Check us out next time. I need a hundred black chalkers for a hundred bad men A hundred black grapes so I can lay they ass in I need a hundred black preachers with a black sermon to tell From a hundred black Bibles Why we send them all to hell I need a hundred black coffins Black coffins Black coffins